Hi everybody, it's Az here from Heel vs. Babyface on the PTR for patch 7.1, which can you believe drops in a week's time today? Well, a week if you're part of the America and Oceanic servers, and a week tomorrow if you're part, like me, of the European servers. Now, if you've watched any of my PTR 7.1 videos, then you may be aware that I have mentioned a couple of times now that I have apparently unlocked some hell yeah world quest but I couldn't find any anywhere so I, I was wondering what on earth was going on or whether it's something that Blizzard had planned and ditched or whatever but as you can see on the screen right now I'm actually involved and they're being called the Hellia Invasion Quest so it's like the forces of Hellia have started to invade the Broken Isles and step up uh, their uh, whatever their gender is I'm not actually sure what her agenda exactly is uh, but that's why we have the second raid in the trial of valor as well now one of the reasons why I couldn't discover any of these world quests is I was actually looking for them as part of a new faction uh, a potential new reputation for us to grind in 7.1 alas that is not the case. They're actually part of the Valajar series of world quests. So that's why I may have skimmed over them and they might have actually been on the world map before. Now, I've got to immediately correct myself because I said them. Uh, this is the only one that I've come across. And when you actually get to this part of Azuna, because this actually takes uh, place on the western coast of Azuna, uh, in actual fact, it's right by an area where I have had world quests for farming leather as part of my leather working. Uh, so I don't know how that's going to be affected. Uh, and maybe this effect, you can see you've got this mist effect. This was first brought in in Wrath of the Lich King uh, when we were doing the, is it Caval? Uh, uh, quests, I was going to say world quests, there weren't any world quests then, uh, the Cavaldia quests in the top of Ice Crown, the north of Ice Crown, and also in the Borean Tundra on the western coast of the Borean Tundra, if you started off in that zone, you'd get this mist, there was this really cool little quest chain where this mist sort of surrounded your screen and you had to fight your way out of it. Uh, well, that surrounds this whole area, and even when I completed it, and went back to it, uh, it still appeared. Uh, and of course, there is actually a rare mob uh, that appears here and such. So maybe, maybe this is just something which needs to be ironed out. Or when the world quests change and this one officially leaves uh, the ranking of world quests, uh, then everything will just return back to normal for a few days. But this is the only one that I could find. This is the only area around the Broken Isles. I actually did a full tour de force around the outside, true story, of the Broken Isles to see if I could uh, and come across any of other areas which were going to mist up like this. Now, not that they were going to immediately give me a world quest, not too bothered about that, they pop when they pop, but just to see where other potential areas could be. And as far as I'm aware, Unless they've got something planned, this was pretty much it. So unless they are phased questings, which can appear in multiple different zones, which I really do hope, uh, this really seemed to be the only area uh, to have a crack at. But during the course of this week, I will keep my eye on the PTR servers. I will see if a Hellia invasion quest pops in another zone, and therefore I'll be able to keep you abreast of that. But for now just seems like the one, uh, which is really kind of bizarre. And it is a standard world quest. There's nothing uh, different here. It's not like the Kirin Tor, where we have something a wee bit unique. I do like the Kirin Tor quest line. I do like the fact that they have something that is a little bit different. No, this is a bog standard. Kill the guards, destroy the weapons racks, and that is that. So I ain't going to lie to you. Um, it ain't the most exciting thing in the world that I've ever done. I didn't leave the Hell Year Invasion quest, world quest, thinking, wow, that was really cool. I can't wait to see what to do next. It was kind of like, okay, uh, what was my reward? I should have brought my bodyguard. 
Got myself 65 extra gold. Uh, it was kind of like that. Uh, so not going down on it. I'm not, not ragging it. But I'm just saying that um, I was kind of hoping that some of the new world quests would actually have something a little bit different. And thus far, just seems to be standard fare. So let me know what you think in the comments section down below. Did you believe that the new world quest coming in 7.1 would actually bring something different? Or did we expect that things would pretty much just stay the same. But I hope you enjoyed the vid regardless. And if you did, do give it a thumbs up. And also subscribe to my channel. Follow me on social media and Twitch for live streaming. Links there in the description down below. What I'm trying to do is just see if the mist disappears. And things go back to normal. But I'm just, no. Uh, and I'll be back with some more stuff very soon. You take care, everybody. Bye-bye.